going to go down. Now, the, uh, the blue team is fighting what is uh, the red team. There are three people down there we haven't seen that much in terms of the red team's DPS. We have uh, seen, however, that they do have Tell three supports. We normally, uh, we very rarely see three supports. Normally, it's either three tanks or three DPS. Uh, we have pretty much never had a three support composition. Now, we are going to see it. We are going to see it working anyways. Uh, and the red team is going to activate a Zenyatta ult. The blue team should probably back up before that goes even more south from uh, for them. Genju getting picked off. He is going to be the last to be picked off as, uh, as the blue team backs up and they do regroup. Uh, we are going to see the blue team switch uh, out their mercy for a Moira. We, uh, we do often see a lot of Moira, and we do know that Moira is a very fair discord. We're going to see the uh, the red team's Farah pushing up, dying to the Genji. Uh, that is going to give the red team opportunity. Genji able to get the Lucio as well with the help of Zenyatta. Zenyatta's din scores certainly a very big help for the blue team. Genji getting the deflect on the McCree that is going to be a free kill for Genji. A kill that he would have gotten anyways. Genji stopping Diva from getting back in back. This is quite massacre. Genji at the center of it, looking for more red team. He is going to see Moira. He is going to almost get Moira. That beat drop saving her life, saving uh, the what is almost the last of the red team. Uh, we are going to see, however, the Moiras fighting each other. Genji looking for some kills. He is going to find the Zenyatta. Can he parallel. find a, a, a second? The answer is no, but he is going to be able to get the D.Va out of mech. He is looking for more kills. Can he get uh, the Lucio? With the help of Zenyatta's ult, it doesn't look like he will be able to do it. Uh, Hanzo, however, popping off, able to get to Eva finishing off on the enemy D.Va. This is just brutal. Moira on, from the red team is going to be pushing up. Uh, she is going to try and get kills. The answer is she can't. Nobody can. The blue team is unkillable. Never mind. Zenyatta landing. Quite the lucky headshot on the Genji. It does look like Farah is going to be pushing up. They are going to die to the Moira. Uh, Lucio also pushing up with Diva onto the point. Uh, the blue team trying to hold them off. Trying to get kills and get uh, and keep the ground that they have earned. We are going to see the Moira ult able to kill the Zenyatta. Uh, not able to get much else done, however. Uh, Monkey's going to kill me. The, uh, with the blue team almost losing the point, uh, not able to fully capture it. However, the red team stepping off, losing the capture ground that they had, uh, trying to keep what they had, uh, how they had it, and hopefully uh, keep the point, gain the point. Uh, we are going to see the red team Zenyatta uh, pushing up, using their ult, trying to get uh, ground, and we are going to see the blue team Genji board. saving onto his ult for a little bit longer, using it now, looking for a few kills. He is going to get one, can he get two? Looks like the answer is yes, can he get a third? Lucio pushing up onto the point, trying to get a kill. Uh, looks like he's going to back up. No, he's very indecisive here. He's getting chased by Genji, by the blue team. This is quite brutal. We are going to see, however, the Genji ab uh, not able to get this uh, Lucio, this Lucio all over the place. I can't even follow him. Uh, and it does look like the red team may actually have some sort of ground here, but with the uh, with the Winston dying constantly and the uh, Diva going down, that is going to be the end of the first round with the blue team taking the point from the red team. These callouts are fucking great. I feel like it's a little biased on who you're calling out. Starting off round two, it does look like the blue team is going to be keeping the team composition the exact same. Uh, this did work for them. This is quite the smart decision to keep your team composition with what worked. Again, if it isn't broken, why fix it? Now, we are going to see, uh, we do not know what the red team composition is. We do know that they have to find out a solution to the blue team's mass murdering skills here or they won't be able to get the uh, to win this second round and if they don't win this second round that will be the end of the match very very quickly now we are going to see the blue team pushing up left side uh the red team did get a get uh, did get a junk right not able to actually gain any ground for the blue team however uh and it looks like uh the red team is already going to be two people down a symmetra and a uh and a junkrat it looks like 
they are going to get the Genji to kick off the McCree. Genji also able uh, to, with the help of the godly Hanzo we are seeing from the blue team, uh, kill the Lucio, maybe get more. It does look like the Etra is getting some uh, effectiveness from her turrets here. Can we see a Widowmaker kill? The answer is no, but we are going to see a Genji kill on the Widowmaker. It looks like this Genji is deep in the red team, not going to die, however, taking uh, Diva out of the mech with him, able to hurt the Junkrat who did die to the soldier. We are going to see the Genji. Oh, can he get two? Yes, he can. Can he get three? Maybe. Uh, it does look like with the help of his team, he is going to be able to get four. Jesus Christ, this is a massacre. The Bright team just has no solution for it. Genji looking to charge his ult a little more, pushing up, trying to get some damage off on the red team. Uh, staying away from the Winston because he knows that that is a lot of damage. Uh, that Diva Discord. And deflect that he is going to have to tank. If he Monkey Discord. Close. Monkey is going to die, however, and that Reinhardt does give just... Genji the confidence uh, with... It helped to go a little bit further in. However, McCree is going to be able to get the kill onto the Genji. Uh, but that doesn't matter. The blue team is strong enough on their own, with the, even with a player down, to keep this point. The red team has no solution. They have no answer. All this Monkey is a massacre. Uh, Monkey going down to the soldier. To Reinhardt the discorded. Yana's discord. A key point, uh, a key part, and a key number of plays in this match. And it does look like we are going to get Hanzo's ult. He isn't able to do that much with it. We are, however, going to see Genji getting flash, not dying yet. Uh, he's Diva, Diva. back up. We are going to see Moira pushing up, not dying, however. Or uh, not able to survive. Uh, and we are going to see Genji trying to follow up on that, yet still not quite able to get uh, the kills that he wants. He is not going to go down still able to survive, uh, able to fight and get the McCree deep in the red team's back line. Uh, it does look like the blue team is going to uh, have to back up, have to regroup here. Uh, Genji not seeming to follow that order, uh, backing up a little bit more. Uh, the blue team does have all three of the guys pushed up uh, within line of sight on the point, watching the point, looking for uh, some kills, maybe an early pick, maybe something that can start off a push. It looks like they are going to find on the uh, uh, Zenyatta using his ult, trying to get damage off, trying to get uh, healing to his team, to the people on his team that need it most. We are going to see the Bastion in turret form. Reinhardt just get a kill. It doesn't look like he nice dies to the deep. Genji getting a kill on the Reinhardt, stopping the Reinhardt from being able to hold the point, and that is going to be the second round. The red team just had no answer for the brutal punishment that the blue team was handing them. Thanks, man. <laughs> Yes.